When most people think about international trade, they picture shipping containers. Pallets are less iconic, but they're just as important. Pallets and container shipping can lower the cost of moving things from one place to another. That's one reason why global trade has grown so much over the years. But while globalization has improved the lives and livelihoods of many people around the world, not everyone has shared in the gains. That needs to change. Globalization is built on the idea that integration and exchange help economies and people thrive. Governments set up the World Trade Organization in 1995 to provide a set of rules to ensure that global trade in goods and services flows as predictably and as freely as possible. Since then, trade has helped raise per capita income and create jobs in rich and poor countries. For low-income households, trade has lifted purchasing power by providing access to more goods and services at lower prices. Trade-led growth in developing countries has helped cut the share of people living in extreme poverty by over 70%. Open global trade has become a vital means for addressing a wide range of global challenges, from food security to coping with the effects of natural disasters. Trade also enables access to green technologies needed to decarbonize our economies. The global economic landscape continues to evolve with e-commerce and digitally delivered services creating exciting new trade opportunities for businesses big and small. At the same time, global political tensions are straining trade relations. Global economic fragmentation would be extremely damaging. Poor countries and low-income households would be hit the hardest. Cross-border problems like climate change would become even harder to solve. What we need instead is what we at the WTO are calling re-globalization by bringing more people and places from the margins to the mainstream of the global economy, we can build a more inclusive world and one that is more resilient to shocks. Building on foundations laid over the past 80 years, the WTO can support a more prosperous, more inclusive and more sustainable future through re-globalization. Everything here is at the right place, at the right time, and nothing gets lost. It's incredible. Have you seen my khakis? 